Today I want to talk about migraines. Now traditionally migraine sufferers are given a treatment to take when they have a migraine and this doesn't do anything to prevent it. If you have enough migraines a month then you're put on a preventative treatment which is often a beta blocker or a calcium channel blocker and those can make you tired, can affect your blood pressure and possibly make you gain weight. We like to get to the treatment to aim at the cause of the, of the migraine. And in my experience, it can usually be because of an imbalance in female hormones. Some people have migraines at the beginning of the month, right when they have the period. Some have them in the middle, and some have them before the, the period comes. So it's important for us to do a menstrual diary to determine when it comes, and sometimes we do an 11-day saliva test, which maps out your hormone levels. The second thing that I can see cause migraines in my practice is food intolerances. Clearly, identifying foods that are triggers and causing intolerances and reactions and just eliminating those can be very helpful in treating migraines. And the third thing that I've seen is low adrenal function. That involves your hormones DHE and cortisol. So we do saliva testing um, to um, identify the cause. So it's very important for you to identify the cause of your migraines and that way we can treat that and prevent you to have not as many.